Welcome to Unbelievable. I am Boo. On today's episode, we are doing another unboxing. This time, it is the Legion of Collectors DC on TV box. So let's get into it. All right, guys. So today, we're doing another unboxing video. This time, it is the Legion of Collectors DC on TV box. I am real excited. As you can see, we have Arrow right here on the front of the box. Just recently, I've been getting into the Flash TV show. I caught up on season one. I'm all the way caught up to season two. I'm about to start Arrow. I've watched a few episodes of Supergirl, but I haven't, um, you know, really been too much into the DC on TV universe. But The Flash is like one of my favorite shows, so I'm really excited for this box. So let's open it up and see what we got. All right. So we open it up real quick. As we can see, we have our nice uh, comic book art in there. And... We have our Legion of Collectors patch. It is a Supergirl patch. That's pretty sleek. I like the kind of the design of it, the shape of it. That's pretty cool. And then we have our we have Adam as our Legion of Collectors pin. Now I do know the Adam uh, has made a few appearances on uh, the Flash. I know he's in uh, DC Legends of Tomorrow and also uh, Arrow. So Adam's kind of been all over the place. So. We have Adam right there, and uh, pretty cool. Seems like a, a cool character. Once I get more caught up in the DC TV universe, probably like this pin a lot more than I do already. All right, so pretty cool. Now let's get into the main bulk of the box. I did look at spoilers. Not spoilers, but teases for this box, and they pretty much gave away the stuff. So I'm pretty excited for what we got in here, but there's still some surprises. I don't know exactly specifically what's in here, so let's check them out. All right, so we have a, oh cool. So we have an Arrow t-shirt, as you can see right there. And it has the Arrow, and it's not a pop art t-shirt, it's just a regular Arrow. And it says, only weapon. Only weapon, Oliver Queen. Okay, so we have Oliver Queen right there, the arrow. I like that t-shirt, pretty cool. Uh, the green, black, not a pop art. Again, I like that. Not all these shirts have to be pop art ones. Next up, we have my boy, The Flash. And as you can see, it is the Legion of Collectors variant cover. It is the Flash that we know from the TV show. And so, pretty sick, it is Flash number 123. And then we have Barry Allen right there as the Flash. I like that. Really, really cool. And now, two pops. Let's start off with... Oh, not two pops. <laughs> My bad. It is Rock Candy Supergirl. So, I don't have any Rock Candies. And this one is the Rock Candy of Supergirl, okay? And I guess they have other Rock Candy uh, vinyl collectibles, such as Harley Quinn, Batgirl, Wonder Woman. Um... And so we get the Supergirl rock candy, and she's really, really cool. Uh, she looks to have a really good paint job and everything. I can't see too many issues with her. Uh, these have an interesting style to them. They look really, really nice. Definitely cool to display. And uh, like I said, I haven't watched much of the Supergirl. I think I've watched like one or two episodes. Really hoping it hits Netflix uh, this summer so I can catch up on all of them. What I did take away from those first few episodes is she's just a really cool character. Um, she was very relatable, like when she's, you know, not flying around. I thought the girl they got to play her was just kind of really cute, really funny. And so, um, definitely interested in catching up more on this show. And I really like this rock candy. I'm not going to probably go buy a whole mess of rock candies, but to get one in a box and to it to be the first time we've gotten a rock candy or something different in any one of these Funko boxes, um... I'm pretty excited about that. I'm happy with it. I know there might be some haters on this one, but yeah, whatever. We can't all, you know, be happy with these boxes. But I say, you know, anytime we're getting some really cool stuff that we're not used to getting, I'm going to be happy. And next up, and I already knew about this pop, but I'm probably most excited for this. And that is we have Mr. Jay Garrick, okay? Now, if you've been watching the Flash TV show in season number two, Jay Garrick plays a prominent role in the show, and uh, basically this pop is amazing. 
It has him with that kind of classic looking flash helmet on. As we know, Jay Garrick's also a speedster and, you know, just really, really cool pop. Uh, so this is exclusive to this box and it's my first flash pop. I've just recently gotten into the show. I haven't purchased any yet. I want them really bad, but I've kind of been holding off, not buying as many pops these days. But I'm definitely excited to pick up some more flash pops. I do have an unmasked uh, flash coming soon, hopefully. This was from Forbidden Planet. I know they sometimes take a long time, but when I have that come, we'll definitely have a video checking that out. All right, so let's kind of go over the box real quick. We started off this box with our awesome patch and pin. The Supergirl patch, the Atom pin. Eh, the Atom pin, the more that I think about it, I wish they kind of picked another character. There's far more cool characters, I think, from the uh, DC kind of uh, TV universe to pick, but maybe I'm just biased towards the Flash. But I think this would have been a really cool thing to do, like a Captain Cold right here. Captain Cold, I think, would have been sick on here. So, um, But Adam's cool, and I know he's been in a lot of the different DC shows. Supergirl patch, probably very appropriate. She really had a good season. I know they don't know if she's going to be on uh, CBS next year or CW. I'd say they should probably just move her over to the CW. I mean, that's probably where that show is going to get the ratings and the views that it should get if they just move it over to CW. But really cool patch. We had our Flash comic book. Okay, variant cover with the actual TV Flash on there. Pretty awesome. I like it. I think this probably really cool, the T-shirt. Uh, just having the Arrow t-shirt. Now, I don't know if everyone gets the Arrow t-shirt or if some people got Flash or some people got Supergirl. Um, if that's the case, I really wish I would have gotten Flash, but, you know, I'm happy with the Arrow. I like the black and green. I think that looks pretty sleek. We have our Rock Candy Vinyl Supergirl, and she's just really awesome. You know, the blonde hair, the kind of skirt-looking uh, outfit and everything. I like the box. I dig it. Good job, you know. Uh, I won't be upset if I see more Rock Candy in boxes um, from Funko. Not just DC boxes, but any of the other boxes too. Bring them on. And then, probably just my favorite. This is probably one of my favorite pops we've gotten in a box, DC or otherwise. Just this Jay Garrick. Really, really sick. Um, loving the Flash right now, so I think I'm just extra pumped because it's from the Flash. But really, really cool. Anyway. If you like this video, please hit the thumbs up button. Also subscribe and in the comments section, let me know. What do you think about the DC on TV box? For me personally, pretty happy with this box. I love this Jay Garrick. I mean, The Flash. It's been unbelievable having you. Until next time, guys, take care.